really simple right this is all you do but yet many students struggle okay so let's let's um, look at a few examples to see how we can apply um, this this concept we just learned today the question says there are 0.25 moles of CH3COH how many atoms are there in total okay so we apply what we've learned you can see we're basically going from mole uh, to molecules we're given the number of moles and we're, we're trying uh, to find the number of atoms, right? Okay, so there's 0 0.25 moles. So first thing, we need to find how many molecules there are. We cannot go straight to atoms, remember? So we multiply by 6.02 times 10 to 23, okay, so to get the number of molecules. Now we have got the number of molecules, okay? But in each molecule, how many atoms there are? If you count, you can figure out there are eight atoms in CH3COH. In each molecule, there are eight atoms. So after getting the number of molecules, you number multiply by eight in order to get the number of atoms there are. Okay. We have covered the first subchapter of quantitative chemistry. You should be able to ace all the chapter, all the uh, exam questions for this subchapter. 
if you have understood what I've just talked about uh, in the video. Okay, so if you want to learn about other chapters, if you want to do well in your IB diploma, if you want to be ahead of your peers, and if you want to get into top universities, I strongly urge you to come for a free trial lesson. Our center currently tutors over 100 IB students. Each of them at least achieve a level of improvement. Okay, so I hope that we can serve you and see you soon.